first day, we have our first crew of scouts coming, and Hal has led us out here. And, you know, it's the usual. It takes us forever to get out of the parking lot, to get here, to schlep all the stuff out here. We have all this stuff. I've brought coolers of food. We're all ready to go. One of our friends, Jim Glank, sits down on that log, and he says, you know what you need out here? And I said, what? You need a bench. <laughs> A bench for the audience watching me build a bench. Hey, Ed. Hi. Good to see you. It's a really nice day. <laughs> it's an excellent day. It's been Good. a long time. Yeah. You're in college now. Yeah, I am. Where are you going to college? Uh, University of Puget Sound. Up in Tacoma. Tacoma. I think yeah. Back to our first meeting in the office when you came in and we talked about. Yeah. How, how old were you then? Uh. When was that? That would have been... a couple years ago almost. I was probably 16. Yeah. 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 And so this is the bench that you built to earn your Eagle Scout back? Yeah. Is that yeah. right? So I want to know, when you decided to do this, did you have any idea what you were getting into? I mean, not really. Every weekend in September we spent building it, and then another two weekends in October, I think, to finish it up. So people out here building it, your, your yeah. scout troop and... Yeah, the, 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 the people would kind of change between... Sure. But, yeah, um, it's volunteers. Yeah. I know how it goes. Yeah, yeah. exactly. And um, so, who helped you? Like, what kind of mentoring did you get? Well, Hal helped me a lot. I bet he it did. It was without him, I would, this would just be a pile of rocks lying <laughs> on the ground and maybe some wood. Uh -huh. um, he pretty much showed me how to build a bench because I have no idea how to build a bench. Um, yeah. And he, he showed me like what to do, how I could get the rocks, how I could like build the whole foundation of the structure and then yeah. how I could just do everything. <laughs> well, you had him and uh, you got it done and I think it's great. Now, you built this bench first and then almost a year later, we built this trail yeah. and put in this railing and it's kind amazing. Of, yeah, what do you think about this now? That it's, it's all I, I know, better. before it was just in this in this place, I was like, how, how are people going to come out here and yeah. see this bench? Because it's kind of just off in the woods somewhere, but now it's like there's this whole trail and set up all around it. It's really cool. It seems like a really awesome place to just come and enjoy nature. Yeah. So outside. in a few more months, you know, the rains will come, the, the river will rise, this backwater will have flow in it, birds yeah. and turtles and fish will be out. Do you think you'll, you'll come down here? I mean, I'd like to see it in, in all of its different seasons. So I notice over here this nice plaque. Yeah. It's dedicated to your dad. But yeah. um yeah, we thought it'd be a really cool idea to dedicate it to my dad because yeah. a year before um, we started building like a little over a year he passed away and so I don't know. We just we just thought it'd be really cool to Do you think he'd like it? Yeah, he'd really like it cuz I don't know, he was a big construction guy and oh, so okay. I don't know, all of my life we try and do little construction things from like building little models to um we built an elevator that went up to a tree fort, like that was fully operated. We tried; it worked once, and then it broke. <laughs> Stuff like that. So my dad would really appreciated building things. You built this, and this is solid. Yeah, this is solid. It's not so gonna break. My dad would be happy that I that I at least tried to use some of the skills that he taught me. And you did it. Yeah. You did it. No, we're real pleased with the project. We're real proud of you. Yeah. And happy with how it turned out, and you know, you've done something, built something here that not only you can enjoy for the rest of your life, yeah. and when you have a family, they can enjoy it. But everybody who comes to this park, which is thousands and thousands of people, yeah. can come down here and enjoy this now and indefinitely into the future. Yeah, so. hopefully this thing will stay strong for a long time. I know these these supports, they there's a lot in them that yeah. are, that's holding them together, so they should definitely stay there for many years. <laughs> Well, you've, you know, you've really made a difference here. Oh, yeah. And, uh, and that's what being a friend of you for Park is all about. So, way to go. All right. Well, thank you. Good job, Ed.